One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Give me an oi. Two oi. Three oi. There's lots more at MattYee.com and the Matt Yee Fan Club on Facebook. Aloha. Do ya, do ya, hey, everybody. Do Welcome to Matt Yee's dance. Happy Hour. So glad you guys are here. Do ya, do Start ya, typing. Tell us who's here, where you're dance. from. Meet each other. Say hello to everyone. Hey, Joe. Oh, Joy. Hi, Joy. Hey, Jeremy. And yeah, Washington State's in the house. Montreal. Once again, this is how we connect with each other. Everybody, let me know where you're from. Also, start typing in the names of your friends so they come in and join us too. The more, the merrier. Do you want to dance? Hold my hand. Tell me that I'm your lover man. Oh, baby, baby, baby. Do you want to dance? Hey, Facebook, where are you? I want to see you. Because we can make romance. Wander the moonlight. Hug me. Squeeze me all through the night. Oh, baby, baby, baby. Do you want to dance? want to ask me anything, go ahead and just Venmo it to me and we're going to get to it. Some, it's a new segment in the show. And yes, this is our virtual tip jar. This is how we pay the bills. It's Venmo, Matt Yee, just a tip, and paypal.me slash Matt Yee 69. Under this moonlight, hug me. Squeeze me all through the night, oh baby, baby, baby. Do you wanna dance? Do ya, do ya, do you wanna dance? Do ya, do ya, do you wanna dance? Do ya, do ya. Do ya, do ya, want to dance? Oh, do ya, do ya, do ya, want to dance? Tell me, do ya, do ya, do ya, want to dance? Once again, let us know where you're from. Say hello to each other. Riley, if I could see the Facebook comments on my feed, that would be great. If not, we can switch her. Do ya, do ya, do ya wanna dance? Do ya, do ya, do ya wanna dance? Do ya, do ya, would you do ya wanna dance? Would you dance with me? Do ya 
Aloha, everybody. How are you doing out there? Yeah, so glad you're here. My name's Matt Yee. This is the Matt Yee's Happy Hour. We just want to put a smile on your face and have hopefully have someone sit on it. But I'm going to have my pal right here, Jose. He's our sound guy. Why well, go ahead and wave in them. There you go. We've got Riley Tench in Alaska. He's our producer. Hello. Yes. And we've got a special guest coming on a little bit later. Fabulous. Miss Sean Pulaski, a comedian and head of social media meltdowns on YouTube. All right. I'm going to ask Jose here to put up uh, the Matt Yee fan club on Facebook so I can see the Facebook comments over there. By the way, this is for adults only. Adults only. So if you're a kid, get the f out. Go upstairs. Masturbate. Vagina. Of course, what can I do? You know, like there's no, this is not like on the ships where there's security. But. Well, it's about nine o'clock on a Saturday. Regular crowd shuffles in. Where's my regulars? Where are you? There's an old man right there sitting next to me, making love to his tonic engine. Hey, Katie, how are you doing, Sally? Oh, yeah. Good to see you folks, the old gang. Pennsylvania's in the house. Let's see. Let's scroll those and see who's here. Richmond, Indiana. Wow. Good to see you. Glad you're here. Nicole and Marion Veda. Yes. Once again, if you're on Facebook, go ahead and type the names of, of your friends so they see this and they can come and join us. If you're watching this on the rebroadcast, make sure that... Uh, you type in and say hello, because we read all your comments. So, son, can you play me a melody? I'm not really sure how it goes. Because it's sad and it's sweet, and I knew it complete. When I wore a younger man's clothes, oh, life. Now, some of you who are newbies, I understand you're not singing. I can't hear you. We don't care if you don't know how to sing. We don't care if you suck. All we care is that you sing loud. So how are you going to sing? How are you going to sing? If you don't know the words, you just sing na na. Rock the boat. Sing along. Here we go. Sing us a song. You're the piano man. Sing us a song tonight. Because we're all in a mood for a melody. But you got us feeling all right. Once again, if you have any questions or you have a comment, send them to me, especially on Venmo or PayPal, because I will read it. Thank you, Nicole Feeney. I appreciate that little something. Also, the opportunity to do my videograms for you. Also, I, I like to thank people personally. So, uh, Amy Sullivan, $100. Thank you so much. Really appreciate that. Um, Renee Egbo from Last Time, $20 for the cruise show. Glad you enjoyed that. Donna Ward, we didn't get to you. $20. Thank you much for the happy hour. Well, John at the bar. 
Well, there's no John at the bar. That's just you. He gives me my drinks for free. And he's quick with a joke. And he'll love your smokes outside. There's some place he'd rather be. He said, Bill, I believe this is killing me. As a smile ran away from the face. Cause I swear I could be a movie star. I could get out of this place. Oh, la da 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 da. Everybody say, a la da 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 da. Hands in the air, sway, rock the boat, sing along. Here we go. Sing us a song. You're the piano man. That's right. Sing us a song tonight. Cause we're all in a mood for melody. You got us feeling all right. Once again, we want to know who's out there, so go ahead and let us know. That's how that's how Facebook would let more people see it. That's right. So go ahead and type in the names of your friends. Say hello to each other. That's right, Dennis Ryan. Talking about you. Monica Mappa, Alex Sister, and a professor over in San Francisco. So glad you're watching. Penny, oh, thank you. I appreciate that, that I am your piano man. Paul over there, he's a real estate novelist. Never had time for a wife. Hmm. He's quick. He's sitting with Davy, who's still in the Navy, and probably will be there for life. And our waitress. She's practicing politics as you businessmen slowly get stoned. We're all sharing a drink called loneliness. Why? Because it's better than drinking alone. All right, everybody, raise your glasses. Raise your Hello, Chinese people. I'm talking to you. Raise your glasses. If you don't have a glass, hello, you're at home. This is the virtual schooner bar. You don't have to wait for the waitress. You don't want to wait after the bar server. Raise your glass and teach you an ancient wine word. Give me an oi. Two oys. Three oys. Mm. And if you're a newbie, we welcome you. So glad you are here. Tell me if you're a newbie. Hey, Alex, how are you doing? Barbara, that's right. Say, a la da 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 da. Hands in the air. Hello, Chinese people. Hands up. Sing us a song. You're the piano man. Sing us a song tonight. Good night, Monica. That's you all in the mood. Hey, Daryl. Melody. You got us feeling all right. Well, look at it, you all. You're a pretty good crowd. That's right. For a Saturday, manager gives me a smile. Who's the manager? Oh, it's me. I know that it's me you folks have come to see, and I really appreciate that. That's why we do this. You give us purpose to forget about life. Oh, hey, Tracy. Hey, Paul. So glad to see you. And the piano, it sounds like a carnival. And the microphone smells like a beer. So you sit at the bar. And say, Matt, what are you doing here? Oh, la da 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 da. Thanks for the 20 bucks. Appreciate it. Sing us a song. I'm the piano man. That's right. Sing us a song tonight. That's right, Raphael. You're all in a mood. A melody. You got us feeling all right. Well, 
welcome to Maggie's Happy Hour. Woo! Give me an oi. Two oys. Three oys. Mm. I'll tell you, it's been like... <laughs> Well, I started doing this show in March, right after we got back from a ship called the Anthem of the Seas. And I immediately went online. So if you're a newbie, I've been on ships for like a gajillion years, just like Riley. He's been on ships for like two years. But Riley just got home from, a, uh, from the Quantum of the Seas in Asia. He was there. Yeah. And if you go and see on YouTube, which is Matt E shows on YouTube, if you go see the last show, you will see Riley and his girlfriend Cassandra who does all our posters yes indeed and she's very good graphics designer <laughs> yes she's excellent and you can hire her but they were she was in Hong Kong eating noodles and he was in South Korea flying home it was the first time they were separated in like four and a half five months that was an awesome Hi, show sir. go check it out last week Saturday check it out guys Now he's producing this show because our other producer, Joey. It's his birthday. His legs are in the air. Yeah, he's <laughs> bottoming now for some bear out in the woods. Thank you, Penny. I love you too, always. Riley, do we have anybody in the green room that can lead a role? Or you let me know, all right, if we do. Nobody yet, but guys, join the stream. We've got a live audience. It's amazing. You just have to click the link. I'm going to post it one more time. But seriously, get in here. It's, it's tons of fun. All right, go to the comments. Click on that link. You'll get in the green room, and we can actually have a live audience now. All right. I'm going to bring out my husband. Husband, Paul, where are you? So that we can get a blood up. Everybody give it up for my hubby of 26 years, is it? There you are. Come on up, go on the screen right here. Oh, there you are. <laughs> That's right. I know. We're all, look, he looks like he just woke up. Isn't he hot? He's hot. You know what? Everybody, raise your glasses. Raise your glasses. Let's get in the mood. Give me an oi. Two oys. Three oys. Mm. All right. Why'd you hear that? Where's that coming from? <laughs> yeah, I think that's you. <laughs> All right. This is live theater, folks. <laughs> we have, that's right. It's live theater. Hey, Jacqueline, good to see you. So things will happen. But our main thing is just to relax with you. It's Saturday. Let's have a good time. It's happy hour. Drink more. You won't even notice it. That's right, Nessie. And if you're watching on the rebroadcast, I want to let you know that you're here too. So I want to take us back. Let's go back to the ships. And if you've never been on the cruise, we're going to take you there right now. Everybody point at the magic wand. Point at the magic wand and go, do, 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 do. <sighs> magic. We are now on the Nana of the Seas. And we're going to do an, an ancient Hawaiian incarnation. And it, it goes like this. Because it's astounding. Time is fleeting. And madness will take its toll. So listen closely, not very much longer, because I've got to keep control. I remember doing the time war, thinking these moments when the backwards would hit me, voice would be calling everybody. a jump to the left got that and a step to the right <laughs> that's right just follow Paul put your hands on your hips and your knees in tight and it's about 
out the dodge and really make you go and say, hey, everybody say, let's do the time warp again, louder, let's do again, it's so dreamy, fantasy preemie, because you can't see me, I know not at all. Space out and sensation, cause you're under sedation. What's included? I, I see it all. It's a bit of a mind flip, cause you're into a time slip. Where nothing is gonna be the same. Space out and sensation, cause you're under sedation. Everybody, let me hear you say, Let's do again one more time let's do the time walk again some of you are sitting down at home on your feet come on let's get the blood going it's just a jump to the left and a step to the right put your hands on your hips and your knees in tight and it's a velvet dodge really makes you go insane that move your pelvis. Let's do the time warp again. Thanks, Marianne. Let's do the time warp again. One more time, everybody. Let's do the time warp again. Give it up for Paul. Isn't he cute? I know the same hole for 26 years. Ugh. All right, we have a very special guest this week. You know, for, for about two and a half, three months since March, I've been doing the Maggie's Outrageous Adult Sing Along Show, the ones I do on the ship, and a lot of different themes from divas to church. But this is a little bit different, this happy hour, so I get the chance to introduce you to some really, really cool people. That's right, Jim and Eric, Good. so glad you're here. And once again, thank you, Marianne. Yeah, 30 bucks. I'm glad you're enjoying the fun. Now, she and I have been on ships forever. I, I know, but she looks young, all right? This is old Chinese man. Hello? And if, in case you didn't know, if for the newbies, I'm coming directly from our living room here in Honolulu, in Hawaii. That's why it's sunny outside, whereas probably over there where you are, the sun's going down. And once again, this is for adults only. This is our own special place. And like I said, if, uh, if you have any friends, just Facebook especially, type them in in the comments. And if you're on YouTube or Facebook, go ahead and click on the StreamYard link that Riley put up there and you can be in our studio audience. We want I want to actually see some people that for, for, for the last three and a half months I've been yelling at my stove. <laughs> All right, but to get back to this fabulous person, she and I have been up on deck 13 from Atlantis. If you, if you know that place, that's a magical place where gay men go to enjoy each other's company in the dark. She... <laughs> She's been formed on the main stages all around the world. She's in charge of producing a, a YouTube series called Social Media Meltdowns. We're going to give you a little bit of a sample of that in a little bit. But first, I want to introduce you to her. So we've got a little uh, video we can roll for you. Ladies and gentlemen, this is my great friend, Ms. Sean Pulaski. I grew up Jewish in Oklahoma. It's not funny at all. It's not. Every day of my life was like this. Run, Jew! Run! It's weird. They're teaching self-defense at my gym. If someone comes out with a gun or knife, I'm not going to be like, No! 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 This is how it's going to go down. First... I'm going to shit my pants. I always know when I'm on an airplane with gay men. And this is how I know. As soon as a woman enters the plane with a crying baby. 
Every gay man's eyes just roll back in their head. <laughs> Somebody give that baby a Lunesta. <laughs> I like them Latino. I like them Hispanic. I like them Spanish. Usually with those type of guys comes the uncircumcised. I wasn't ready for that shit. Because it's like a sneaky snake. And then afterwards, it just looks like a, a, a defeated puppet. You know, it's like... And if you were a grown man who gets around town on a skateboard, shame, shame, shame. That's right, stretch it out. Ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, Miss Sean Pulaski. Hey. hey, Sean, how are you doing? Where where are you? Oh, I'm in the glorious COVID capital, California, Los Angeles. You're oh. welcome. Give me an oi. <laughs> oi. Give me two oi. Oi, oi. Give me three fucking oi, oi's. Oi, oi, oi. Mmm. <laughs> Hey, John, tell us a little bit about your uh, social media meltdown YouTube series. It's just taken off. It's exploded. Oh, well, there's so much to say about it, Matt. Uh, basically, Social Media Meltdowns is a show that I started about a little bit over a year ago at the world famous comedy store, uh, which is a big comedy club here in Los Angeles. And basically, um, when, when the quarantine happened, I put it online into a YouTube series and it's comedians and variety artists who have taken real social media posts, like real outrageous social media posts, comments and reviews from places like Facebook, Yelp, Twitter, Nextdoor, whatever, anything that's been put on social media and then they perform it live either as that person or in song or as a puppet show. It doesn't matter. People just get really creative with it. And it's just been a super fun show to produce. Wow, that's amazing. Uh, you know what? I, I did. I just did one for you here in my kitchen. Yes, you will be on this. We, we have the show, a new episode premieres. I got really ambitious when the quarantine happened. Ugh, shame. And uh, so now I have a show every Friday on YouTube with new comedians and variety artists. And Matt Yee is hilarious. And he will be on this Friday. It premieres in real time at 4 p.m. Pacific Standard Time on YouTube. And I love what you sent me, Matt. It's, it's definitely somebody just spewing verbal diarrhea. <laughs> Well, you know, I scoured, I scoured Yelp. I found a, an ancient Chinese restaurant, one-star restaurant review in Dubuque, <laughs> Iowa. And, well, of course, and I of course they gave it a one-star <laughs> in Iowa. <laughs> they were like, the rice is like rocks. <laughs> the, the sweet sour chicken didn't even have sweet sour sauce. <laughs> I love, like, what do they have that to compare to in Iowa? So I was going to do that. And then I found another one um, that actually uh, Baby Yoda really liked. <laughs> yes. You know how I could tell because it was like, oh, yes. Oh, that one's funny. Yeah, that one. Yes. So. I need a Baby Yoda. I just have a big Brazilian to take care of. <laughs> oh, and that. I mean big, big, very big. Don't be, don't be jealous, gays. Do we have any gays out there? Any who's here from Atlantis? Oh, we got Harold, yes. Good to see you there. And um, where's my other where, where are the other folks here from Atlantis? Let me see in the comments. Oh gosh. Oh, look at all of you. There's too many. I can't read it fast enough. <laughs> Surprise. <laughs> they, people out there. They popped up when I started talking. Hmm. Yes, they were like, wow. And uh <laughs> yeah. Oh, thank you very much. Uh, for our happy hours, Tracy B, Tracy Beningo for a twenty dollars.
dollars and 69 cents i love ooh. that i love that Ooh, i know love that 69 that helps you know us keep the Matt, lights on here i maddie i love your royal caribbean like fan base the straight fan base because right now they're watching they're like i had no idea streisand was going to be on matt Yee's show you know just like <laughs> Oh my God, that looks just like Barbara Streisand. Oh, people, is it, is it? people who need people, they're the luckiest people. Oh, I like my singing voices for shit. <laughs> no, but you are fabulous. Oh, look, we just got $20 from Noreen. Thank you, Noreen Ryan. Appreciate that. Um, oh, good. I need to get something from Sephora. Thank you, Irene. <laughs> you know what? I. Royal Caribbean is not all straight. It's mixed. It's it's not just LGBTQA and all the other ones, but it's... it's I like, A. I yeah. A, you bad gay. <laughs> and that Brazilian, just to be clear, your Brazilian is a man, right? Yes, he is. I am married to a Brazilian. And his name is Miss Ritfield, 1981. <laughs> <laughs> oh, she was... Oh, you know what? I, I got an award. Yes, I got an award from um, from <laughs> from the ships. From this is my this is my twenty year award from Royal Caribbean. And oh it's well, we know where that's been. So why don't you wash it off before you <laughs> well, present that to us, Matt? It's really, um, it's for those cold winter nights, like in California or Dubuque, where you can't get <laughs> any Chinese food. That <laughs> it's actually a lube cozy, uh, so it keeps your lube oh, warm good. when you're up on deck. Thank God. Food. Yes. I was going to say, because the size of that, you know, I'm a size queen. It kind of looked like it was for beginners. <laughs> oh, uh, all right. We have to give Sean the full screen because I want her to show everyone just what uh, what her husband looks like. What What do you mean by What? Queen? <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> you said he was huge. He can't be any bigger than an Asian because Asian men are huge. Huge. Cute. How you know, I've shared a bed with you, Matt. So mm -hmm. I know that firsthand. <laughs> All right. Well, um, let's let's give these guys a little bit of a sample of social media meltdowns. Can we do that? Okay, well, Matt, you tell me what you want to hear. So when I'm when when the comedians are choosing what to do for this show, they kind of have to scour the internet. And it can be old stuff, it could be new, um, and it could be a post or comments or reviews. So I have two options here, Matt. So you tell me which one you wanna hear. Okay. I have an option of a disgruntled mom who went to Disney World, or I have real Bette Midler tweets I can do as Bette Midler. So you tell me which one. Get on your, get on your comments, start typing. Let us know because we're gonna let you decide Bette Midler or disgruntled mom Social At media, Disneyland. right? Okay, let's yeah. see what comes. Um, there's a little delay in this whole thing, so we'll do a little musical delay. You know what, Matt? I love the song you opened with. That was a Ben Midler special. Well, <laughs> gosh. Then, oh, Millie wants both. Can we have both? We have both. All right. Let, oh, Monica wants Bet. Okay. And Tracy wants Disney. Shit. Oh, no, sorry, <laughs> Bet. I can't. I have old Chinese man. <laughs> Tracy wants Disney. All right. I have old Chinese man eyes, and my balls have gone dropped. So Paul can oh. testify to that. I lost all that weight, and then. Ooh, they used to be full of fat. Now they're just skin. I have well, skinny you know what? Balls. Don't worry, Matt. My balls dropped too during this COVID quarantine. So, <laughs> all right, disgruntled mom, mom at Disneyland. Oh my gosh, you guys are just YouTubers. Tell us what what you want too. I, I can actually see these. Oh my god, I think you have to do both. Let's start with. Shall we start with uh, <clears throat> Bet? Sure. All right. Let's start with Bet. Are you ready? These are real Bet. Hold on. Let me go to my Twitter. Okay. These are real Bet Midler tweets. 
Oh my God, you stole my wig. Stop it. <laughs> okay, ready? Cold there in my shadow. Perfect. Keep that music going. Okay, hold on. Trump went over 20 hours without tweeting. I'd say he had a bad case of goy aria but you know that wouldn't have stopped him get it goya ria here's another one not police reform tired of waiting for hashtag republicans to recognize your humanity remove a six foot two inch obstruction of america's bowels in november and don't forget his attorney general, human gallstone, hashtag Bill Barr. <laughs> Here's another one. We love this. Go bet. She's mad. Donald Trump has really come a long way. The other day when he vowed to destroy Republican Senator Lisa Murkowski, he did it without calling her ugly or unfuckable. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay, here's a good one. Here's a good one. And now she's always yelling about Trump. Do you think hashtag Ponchi will hunker in the bunker again tonight or sleep all by himself in his big boy bed? <laughs> okay, here's the last one. Hashtag ugly president wants people who come to his rallies to accept waivers so they can't hold him liable if they get the coronavirus. He doesn't give a fuck what you get as long as you give him the clap. <laughs> and there it is, Sean Pulaski reading Bette Midler, real Bette Midler tweets. Wow. It could be Sean Pulaski as, as Barbara Streisand reading Bette, Bette Midler. Tweets. Correct. All right. We're going to bring her back in just a minute, but let's, let's do this. Everybody raise your glasses. Raise your glasses. That's right. I see Sean has a glass. Riley, do we have anybody in the studio who can do this? Let me know. All right, raise your glasses. Give me an oi. Oi. Two oi's. Oi, oi. Three oi's. Oi, oi, oi. Mm. Once again, give it up for Miss Sean Gloss, please. A nibbling on sponge cake. A watching the sun bake. Looking at all of you tourists covered with oil. Well, actually, right here in Hawaii, we don't have any tourists, so we have very little of them because you can't come here, so don't come here. We don't want your COVID germs, Sean. I'm talking about you. That's right. But apparently, after September 1st, we'll take your COVID germs because we're starving. Look at us. Totally left me out. Great. There we go. I wasted it away again in Margaritaville. Everybody help me out. Sing along. I'm searching for a mile. I was shaker of salt. Salt! Salt! Now some people think that there's a woman to blame. But I know it's my own damn fault. Don't know the reason, but I stayed here all season. I got nothing to show but a brand new tattoo. That's right. And it's a real beauty of a Hawaiian cutie. But how we got there, I haven't a clue. Everybody sing, let me hear you. I wasted away again in Margarita Bell. That's right, sing along. Searching for my low shaker of salt. Salt, salt, salt. Well, some people think that there's a woman to blame. But I know it's that Brazilian's fault. I blew out my flip flops. And I stepped on a pop top. And I cut my heel. I had to cruise on back home. But guess what? We have the finest bartenders here on the high seas. You. They got booze in their blenders. And 
soon they will render what? Uh, that grows in concoction that helps me hang on. Uh, hang on, everybody sing along. Uh, waste it away again in Margarita. We're in the schooner bar. That's right, though. Searching for the love shaker is all. So, some people think that there's a woman to blame. But I know it's my own damn fault. Give me an oi, two oys, three oys. Mm. All right, let's bring Sean back. And now, by special request, you wanted disgruntled mom <laughs> social media meltdowns, right from Fresh her YouTube series, Social Media Meltdowns. Okay. This was a Facebook post. Public. It pisses me off to no end when I see childless couples without at Disney World. DW, she abbreviated it, is a family amusement park. Exclamation point, exclamation point, exclamation point, exclamation point. Yet, these immature millennials throw away their money on useless crap. They have no idea the joy and happiness it is to mothers, because I'm fertile, who buys their babies treats and toys. They will never experience the exhaustion that is to chase a three-year-old, thank God, around and getting stares at and assuming I'm a bad mother. This girl in some very slutty, that is capital, capitalized, shorts was buying a Mickey pretzel and Aiden, what an annoying name she named her son, and Aiden wanted one. But the line was very long, so I said later, and it broke his poor little heart, and he cried. I wanted oh. to take that fucking pretzel from that tramp. Like, thanks, bitch. You made my son cry. Sorry. Oh DW is for children. People without children need to be banned. Mothers with children should be allowed to skip all the line. You have no fucking idea what it's like to have to stand in line for e three hours with a cranky, tired, exhausted toddler. And I can't mm. tell him that we can't do something because it's his vacation too. I, I hate childless women with a burning passion. <laughs> Oh my God. Ladies Public. and gentlemen, live from California, a social media rant just for you. Give her a hand, everybody. Virtual hand. This is Sean Pulaski. All right, we're, we're going to bring her back in just a little bit, talk about what it's like to be on a gay cruise. <laughs> gay. But because it's summertime, I, I wanted to uh, do a, a summertime vibe thing for you guys. I don't know if you remember this oldie but goodie, but it's one of my favorite songs about summer. He was working through college. My grandpa's farm. I was searching for knowledge. He had a car. I was caught somewhere between a man and a child. One restless summer, we found love growing wild. 
on the banks of a river of a well-beaten path. It's funny how those memories, they last like strawberry wine. Seventeen, a July moon, I saw everything. First case of love, whoa, bittersweet, green on the vine. Like strawberry wine. I still remember. That's right, talking to you, Riley. When 30 was old, my biggest fear was September. When he had to go, a few cards and letters and one long distance call. Drifted away just like leaves in the fall. But year after year, I come back to this place just to remember the taste. Everybody say, Strawberry wine, 17, a hot July moon. I saw everything. First taste of love. Whoa, bittersweet, green on the vine, like strawberry wine. Years have grown over now, years since we've been the proud, finding what time hasn't touched. Is it really him? Or the loss of my innocence. I've been searching so much. I'm gonna take you back, take you back for the first time. You tried strawberry wine and you went through. I'm gonna take you back for the first time. You did it in the back of your parents' car and you didn't know what to, to do with all that stuff at the end, so you just got a Kleenex out. I'm gonna take you back. And you were on La Cienega and you saw Sean Pulaski at the comedy club. I'm gonna take you back to the schooner bar. July, like strawberry wine, 17, hot July moon, I saw everything, the first taste of love, oh, bittersweet, green on the vine, like strawberry Thank you. I'm just doing a double check. Anybody still out there? We want you to know. And we want to thank you for your virtual tips. We appreciate it. Venmo, Matt, you just a tip. And of course, paypal.me slash Matt, you six nine. Matt, we do actually have someone here. All right. Come on, let's bring them on. Who have we got? Hi. Oh, my goodness, it's <laughs> Cassie. Where are you, Cass? Uh, I'm in Malaysia, and I'm still in bed. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning. You look fabulous. <laughs> we just told everybody about your wonderful posters and everything. And, um, you know, the last time we saw each other, Riley was in South Korea at the airport. Quite That's good true. internet connection, by the way. You were yes, in, the, the Koreans know how to connect to the internet. It's crazy. Right? And, <laughs> and by the way, Riley has had over 300,000 views of his videos on YouTube. So go to Riley Tench, T-E-N-C-H. Put that up on the screen, Riley Tench. I'm sure there's a few YouTube. of you guys watching on YouTube right now. So thank you. Right. <laughs> and, uh, and check out his videos of what it's like to be on a cruise ship with no guests for like 
four freaking months and these two have been together oh this is gosh. a bit of their history five. for those of you who don't know five months and uh i i knew riley when he had 40 uh youtube followers and he was like hey guys thanks so much <laughs> it's amazing and now yeah, i've got twenty six thousand. <laughs> when, i just said twenty six thousand a couple days ago it's amazing this is yeah right this is what happens when you're 22 and you show some skin exactly right so the the the, the <laughs> oh god the gays just went ah i want to like that i want to like that right. it's mine <laughs> you're, you're in freaking malaysia <laughs> yeah um, i can see them and so cassie started. what it's where are you show us where you are let me let me let me just how, how do i turn my camera around oh my god i don't know technology um I really don't know how to turn my camera around. You're in Kuala Lumpur. Just point it out the front. Oh, wow. 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 Look at that. That is gorgeous. There you go, live. All right. I, I right don't know now. if you can see it, but I'm literally in That the looked amazing. Center. Yeah, it's just very, very noisy. Gorgeous. Yeah. And we can tell you just woke up because I can smell you all the way over here in Hawaii. <laughs> I think you had Gylon and Black Bean. <laughs> I see a little chicken feet right here in your like your suit. Well, all right. So glad you guys made it back safe. You're both in quarantine. Is that right? Mm -hmm. Yes. 14 days just hanging out here in my room. Wow, in your room in in Alaska. Yeah. Um, what does Alaska look like? I don't know if we can see that, but I uh, yeah, my webcam <laughs> can't exactly. Right. And I wish. <laughs> now I've got my quarantine wristband. Ooh, very nice. They didn't give me one of those. <laughs> wow. What? So if someone sees you with that outside of your your hotel room, you're toast. Yeah. Shot on the, site. The, the chuck into the jail behind the bars. <laughs> well, I want to put you two together on the screen. Can we do that? And I want to do this poem um, that I wrote for you and people like you that are separated. So if anybody's separated. <laughs> I want you guys to I slow down. I, I don't have a very good way to do that. Anyway, I am your heart. I am your soul. I am the one that you can come home to. Baby, you've traveled the world long enough. I am the one who can share your secrets. I am the one who understands i am the one who protect you baby you traveled around the world long enough long enough i am the one who sleeps next to you i am the one who understands I am the one who knows what to say when the world is scary I am the one you have always dreamed of I am the one who's your kindred soul I am the one who let you go Baby, it's time to come home. Baby, it's time to come home. <laughs> How many dreams must you follow? How many dreams will end? When will you learn that the rainbow's here? It's time to learn. Home is where your heart is, where you can run away. 
so many places my way, but I'm here, I'm here. I am the one who will take care of you. I am the one who understands. I am the one who will be here for you. Maybe you traveled around the world long enough. Long enough. Love Yay! Oh, I you. love your show. I always get our own. Love, love you, time. Matt. I love you. <laughs> you know what? We spent so much time trampsing around Asia and New York and New Jersey. On the quantum of the seas and the anthem of the seas, I'm so glad we've been able to to continue this. Let's bring on Sean Pulaski one more time. Oh my God, is that love fest over? Good God, <laughs> get married. You won't feel that way much longer. Oh, I don't know about that. <laughs> oh, oh, I need a drink, coffee. <laughs> I'm just kidding. That was really cute. So, Sean, in the in the short time that we have left, for all the Atlantis people who've never been on a a, a great a gay cruise. <laughs> By the way, I saw Paul peek his head in, and Paul those white shorts on him. You could see everything. Paul, step in. When you were doing the time warp, stuff was flopping. FYI, we saw it. <laughs> I noticed. And, and my gays were texting me too. We saw it. Thank you. <laughs> Good job, Matt. Good job. <laughs> you thought Asian men are huge. That's why I can't walk for two days. Irish men. Woo! <laughs> so, Sean, uh, my favorite memory of you is going up. Let, let's. Let's do the magic wand thing. Everybody okay. point to the magic wand and you're yes. gonna go doo, 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 doo. We are now on deck 13 on deck 13. Day cruise. Okay. <laughs> Ruse events. And um, deck 13 is that special place where gay men go to enjoy each other's company. And Sean and I walked up the magical staircase up to the to wherever 13 is, it's a metaphor, it's a metaphor, it's a metaphor uh, for that deck. There usually is no deck 13 on a cruise ship. And, uh, well, Sean, what happened? Well, I remember it like it was yesterday, Matt. You and I love to go to the deck, the dick deck together. And as soon as we got up there, and it was dark, but well, you could still talk to people. And suddenly this guy turned around and he saw Matt and he looked at Matt and he goes, oh, hi, Matt. I just sucked off a bear. <laughs> and then we took a moment and then he turned around and then he turned back around again and he looked at me and he goes, oh, hey, Sean. We missed you at Shabbat services. <laughs> Jew, 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 Jew. Oi. <laughs> Two oys. Three oys. <laughs> and then she said, show at 11. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. It's just, I don't know why I scream Judaism when I go into the bowels of the dick deck. But somehow, <laughs> Matt got, he sucked off a bear. I got, we missed you at shul. <laughs> Well, I miss you, Sean. I miss and you too, Matt. What a lovely show you've put together. To, and thank you for having me. We're going to have to do this again. Everybody go make sure you check out the next uh, 
social media meltdowns. meltdowns on YouTube. You can sus subscribe to us on YouTube. You can follow us on Instagram at social media meltdowns. And then we're actually going back live to the comedy store, July 30th, where there will be no audience, but the show will be broadcast live to the audience in the parking lot at social distance tables. How cool is that? It's yeah. very cool. Ooh, I want to be in that parking lot. Wow. Well, parking lot really well. Yeah. You, you're dark. very familiar with dark parking lots, aren't you, Matt? Everybody give it up for Ms. Sean Pulaski. Yes, thanks for being, for joining us and making the show so much fun. Boy, miss you. Miss you so much. Thank you, Sean. Thank you, Riley. Once again, thanks so much for all our special guests, our producer, Riley, over here my sound guy jose sandra uh cassandra twan cassie twan if you're on facebook go friend her and then she'll write your resume she's great at that she's also great at at making posters so all the posters for maggie happy hour she's done and you know what she's in quarantine so she needs something to do hire her all right <laughs> speaking of which watching us on the broadcast or you still haven't done deep time to appreciate that's right matt he does the tip and paypal matt he got me slash matt he 69 this helps all of us at our production company underground music to keep the lights on to, to pay we i actually just went and got upgraded internet now the last Broadcast. I guess we were uploading at two. Yeah, not one, but two. Now we're uploading at 11. So hopefully, bit by bit, we're going to make some purchases now that uh, the state is opening up and we can actually go to a store and talk to a real person. So help us do that. And if you haven't yet, make sure you send me your email so we can let you know when the next. Matt and me happy hour is going to be who our special guests are going to be because I, I send out that email. And thank you, everyone, for your contributions and for just being here. I hope you had a good time. And I know some of you are going to rewind this broadcast and watch it again just to see Paul's junk. So I want you to get really close to your TV and smell it. It smells like Chinese food. Do you remember when we met? That was the day I knew you were my pet. I want to tell you just how much I love you. That was a uh, Videogram request from uh, Vito and Antio and Nessa. This is one of their favorite songs, so I sent them a videogram. I posted some of them on YouTube if you'd like to see them. If you'd like to have one yourself, just message me and we can create it together with your special friends, lovers, and just say hello. I want to tell you. Just how much I love you. Coming up in the future, we're not sure what it's going to be, but the Matayo Band. You hear Do You Want to Dance? Yes, this cassette is finally going to be on iTunes. It's, it's all, that's right, I've been sitting on this for decades. <laughs> and Jose over here, come on over here. Jose, played in the band. He was the world's youngest drummer when he was a psycho about this big. His dad, Joe, was our bass player. And now our bass player, this is the second generation of the Matthias. And once again, send me your email so that I can put you on the You've Got email list. So when it becomes available, you can be the first one to get it. You've heard Do You Want to Dance? Let It Be, all our hits. All right.
right, I'm gonna put this on. Just to remind you what it was like to be in the scene of life. This is Agent Wyan from D2. Everybody put your hands together. There it began. Well, well, well. Well, well, well. Agent Wyan, take a look. It goes like this. There it began. I can't begin to know that I know it's so strong. We can't get it. We got it. It was a spring. The spring became the summer. The leaves became the long. All right, everybody, get your hands out. Here we go. And what did they do? Touching hands. Everybody reach out. Reaching out. Touch yourself. Touch in the Touch somebody else. Hands in the air. Join hands. Here we go. We care a lot. It has never seen so good. So good. I've been in He believed they never would go Look at the night. Don't think so long, baby. You lit up the song, baby. Chance here, here we go. And when I heard. We appreciate that you appreciate us. If you want a little souvenir, this is what we have. These are some of the uh, uh, things you can download from iTunes. Sweet Caroline, Piano Man, all those sing-along songs are right here at Matt E. Live. Um, and we just put up the mic and tape the show in front of live studio on it. So you can actually hear what this should be like, uh, not just on the internet, but uh, over in the schooner bar. Uh, if you like that song long enough, or uh, Gassy and Riley, or along with some of the other songs we've done, uh, it's on this that every facet of my heart, when I was Riley's age. So <laughs> this is Cassie, this is Riley, and they're like, oh, we can't wait to do it. All right, so once again, thank you so much for um, our, all of our guests, our production crew, Sean Pulaski, thank you so much. We appreciate you. Oh, hey, James Riley. Yeah, so glad you're on the other side of the quarantine wall. Can you just wave uh, and so we can see what your face like and what Riley's going to be in like 30 years? I'm glad you're enjoying this. We've run out of time, though. So we'll see you next time. I think we're going to take a break this next week. But hopefully the following Saturday will be there. We'll let you know by email. So if you 
don't get you got email either one it goes to your spam file so make sure you have madamatye.com on your safe senders list or you're not signed up so please send it to me private message me with your email and then we can let you know the most updated things because facebook doesn't always let you know youtube doesn't always let you know things only three percent of you get to see these posts if you're watching on the rebroadcast thank you for being here let me know i want to know who's out there we've had up to 10,000 people 13,000 people watching and if everybody just gave a dollar sean and i could go to vegas and put it all on number 11. Secret of life is enjoying the passage of time. Any fool can do it. There ain't nothing to it. Nobody knows how we got to the top of the hill. Since we're on our way down, might as well enjoy the ride. Secret of love is an opening up your heart. Okay to feel afraid. Don't let that stand in your way. If anyone knows that love is the only road. When it's for standing through space. Smile upon your face. Welcome to the human race. Isn't it a lovely ride? Climbing round, climbing around. Try not to try too hard. It's such a lovely ride. Hello, everybody. Stay safe. Enjoy the time we have together. That's what it's all about, people. Shit's always going to happen, but the friends like Jose here, Riley, Cassandra, Sean, and all my special guests, which you can see on Matt Me Shows on the YouTube channel, go back and check them out. That's your love, dude.